What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Hello there. Hello, my name is Tyler Tarva. Tarva Academy, it's a YouTube channel. A bunch of videos I've uploaded to try to help people learn. So, I don't know why I started out in that voice. It's not my normal voice. This is my normal voice. A little bit more southern accent, but a lot more heart. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Okay, so this is our video series we do for teachers and people or anybody, students, anybody that wants to have this and create a group discussion or just you know think about some quotes that are impactful to them and throughout history and so i threw this uh this challenge out to people on twitter i was like hey give me some quotes i'd love to hear your quotes we've done 100 some of these videos i need some new quotes some fresh fresh quotes out here and emily lynch deegan she stepped up hey and she's an she's an apple teacher and that's really cool too check her out she's at miss deegan underscore mb if you want to check her out on twitter that'd be dope um she had the quote by sally rod and the quote is, all adventures, especially into new territory, are scary. That's good. That's a good quote, okay? I'm gonna tell you my thoughts on the quote, but I'd really love to hear your thoughts. So in the comments, or on Twitter, or Instagram, or wherever you wanna have the discussion, let's talk about this quote. It might be in your Google Classroom with your classmates. That's awesome, that's the dream, okay? But I wanna know your thoughts on this. It's not just about what I think, because you should think for yourself, okay? So I'm gonna throw out my thoughts. All adventures, especially in a new territory, are scary. I would absolutely agree. And you know, there are some people that enjoy change, but a majority, I think it's like what, 70% of the people, according to DISC profiles, they don't like change. They don't like the uncertainty of it. Uh, some people are okay with it because they like mixing it up. And some people just, they like to push through and create new stuff just because that's their personality. But a majority of the, of the people in the population, according to statistics, don't like that change. And even if you're comfortable with it, even if you like it, there's a, it's scary. It's scary to step out into something new. Have you ever stepped out and tried something new or gone up and introduced yourself to someone new or, you know, whatever it is that's out of your comfort zone or out of your, your world you've created and you've gone out and tried something? It's scary because it's unknown. That's what's scary. It's like, it makes me think of in Indiana Jones. Do you remember Indiana Jones in the Last Crusade? Whenever he's got to go through this, like these booby traps and stuff, and he's got to take a, like a leap of faith. He's got to step out onto a ledge. And some of those ledges, they're not, uh, they're not set. He could fall and just, you know, that could happen. Um, it's, that's what I think every time I think of something new or some, stepping out into something that you're not comfortable with or not familiar with, you're taking a leap of faith. I think the thing that we have to do as people is we gotta be okay with taking those chances and taking that criticism because this is our one shot at life. And so it's like, are we gonna waste it worrying about what other people think or the fact that I could fail? No, you're gonna step out there and you're gonna try something and you're going to take a leap of faith and you're gonna go for it with your whole heart. If it works, great. If not, guess what? Doesn't matter, you can try something else, okay? You gotta remember that your failures are not final. Okay, you've gotta be able to learn from our failures. It's not a failure until you quit trying. That's the, that's the cold hard facts of it. So um, those are my thoughts. I think it can be scary, but I think that as long as you have people with you that you trust that are gonna give you honest feedback you can grow from and you have the mindset that it's not final, like you can try stuff and not be good at it and you can try something else and not be good at it and you keep trying things until you find what you love, what you're passionate about, what you're good at. And that's what you do. So those are my thoughts. I'd love your thoughts. If you can say it more concise, if you can say it and you have a personal example or experience, anything related to this quote, I'd love to hear it in the comments of the YouTube video or on your Google Classroom or wherever you're watching this. So thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you so much for your time. I hope you guys, uh, Emily, thank you so much for giving us this quote. That's really awesome. You guys go check her out and follow her. If you wanna subscribe, um, that'll I mean, probably be the best decision you ever make besides all the decisions that are better, so. <laughs> okay, well, I'll see you guys later. Y'all be good. Tyler from Tarver Academy. Never stop learning.